Kate, it's so good to see you. Thanks so much for joining us. And I do love this holiday decor and we're gearing up for the holidays. Do you have any special holiday traditions? Well, usually it involves a cat and a dog. <laughs> um, one of the things is really important to I think, Tidy Cats and me is being able to gift um, give back to shelter, your local shelter around the holidays. So donate, you know, uh, kitty litter, food, time. You don't have to write a check. It's just like a nice way to give back. How long have you had Pablo? Yeah, I adopted him when I got him when he was six weeks old. He's now 18. He still enjoys a little cat knit mouse, but that's another thing we do on the holidays. Keep all the toys in a basket, like a nice decorative basket on the side so nobody slips on a, yeah. on a mouse. <laughs> That's why we teamed up with Kate and Tidy Cats for more perfect tips to make your home festive and feline friendly. And then, you know, for the holidays, like I've got my artificial tree up. You know, if you've got a cat or a dog, you want to be really careful if you do have a fresh tree because they're going to want to go into that water mm -hmm. and have a drink. We're going to have a little party. So, you know, we move the kitty litter from the guest bathroom into another room. You got to make sure that it's a quiet area. And I love the Tidy Cat's lightweight litter. It's 99.9% .9 dust free. Mm -hmm. And it's also got a very light, um, subtle linen scent, which I love, the cat loves, because you don't want it too perfumed. I love that. Um, you have the best cat ever. 